let's not skip ahead of spring. I kind of like spring and then summer. In fact, a lot of spring cleaning has yet to be done. The average person spends about 70 hours each spring cleaning their home, doing that big cleanup inside and out. So what if you can get the same results or even better with less time and money? Well, Mike DePaula, you're an expert in these matters, so I'm going to let you start us off with a lot of tips here and I'm, I'll kind of step out of the way if need be. Great. Well, good morning, Jeff. Good morning Thank to you. Thank you for having us this morning. Uh, here we have outside storage, okay, on your porch or patio. We have different size rubber made cubes <clears throat> and they're made of plastic so they're not going to uh, get moldy and they're waterproof and they come in different sizes. And this quite one, lockable too, right? Absolutely, okay. yes. Yep, that will lock for you. And then this one actually doubles as a table. And again, when you're done with your outside fixtures, you can put them inside. That's sort of like an ottoman. Yes, exactly. If you have it out in, with, exactly. your, with your uh, lawn furniture, right? Right. And so, so you could do the same with this, right? Absolutely. Just a bigger version, hey? Yep. Put some chairs around and you're all set. So we have a, a, a ton of totes uh, available by couple I wanted to just bring in to show you into yeah. the studio. These guys over here? Yes, we have one. Uh, the tote is only good if you have the lid, right? So these totes that we have from uh, Home Depot have the lids actually attached to them. So if I do this, it just, it just closes up for you. Right? That's it. And then you stack right on top of the other. There's a reason why I was never on the prices right, by the way. <laughs> anyway, keep going. <laughs> okay, perfect. And another special tote we have there is our flatbed tote. We call it a flatbed tote. The special thing about that is that slides very easily underneath your beds. It's actually on wheels or out in the garage. It'll slide and make even more space in your garage. So great storage uh, uh, options there. And what else do we have here? Because I noticed you have a lot. <clears throat> well, I wanted to bring the whole store actually, but. <laughs> <laughs> of course. Right, so when we're doing, we're talking about saving time, but we don't want to put garbage into bags and have it rip open halfway down the driveway, have to clean up and clean up again. This is another great product by Home Depot. It's a flex bag and actually grips the top of the rim so it doesn't keep falling in on you. So you have to keep pulling it out. And it's got a uh, tear, it's made of tear resistant material. Ah, good to have. I'm noticing, by the way, and I, oh, go ahead. Yeah, go ahead. Yep, no, we've got a couple more things. You know, you always want a good brush. And this is another uh, great product we have at Home Depot. This is an actual stable brush. And you could open this brush up and it becomes flexible. Ah, okay. So that you could clean underneath. Clean the little corners and that kind of thing. Absolutely. And then a lot of times we're go ahead and we're cleaning and cleaning. We're spraying and cleaning. This you actually fill up and you could just keep going right along. Oh, with the uh, detergent. Yes. I notice you have uh, filters there, like furnace filters. Is it a good time of year to, to be doing that? Absolutely. About every 90 days you need to uh, change your air filters, right? So there's different types of air filters are, are uh, posted there, depending on what type of uh, allergens or particles you want to uh, trap, or they'll go ahead and list it, they're, they're color coded, and then we always have uh, the different particulates listed all the way across. Not terribly, terribly expensive either. And, um, and I, we only have about a minute left, would you believe it? Um, I noticed this is a power washer uh, out here, is that right? Absolutely, this is one of the uh, must have tools for every homeowner. This is our Ryobi 3100 power washer. It is gas powered, so it'll go all around the house with you. And there's some great, great attachments I just wanted to show you. There's actually a 20-foot telescopic pole, which uh, talk about saving time. You don't have to go up and get up and down on the ladder because right here we have a, a gutter cleaner, okay? And ours is better because it doesn't spray into the gutter and come back on you. It sprays simply left and right. Ah. You don't get on the ladder and you're doing it from the ground floor. Good plan. And you rent or buy one of those things? We have say? a tool rental center. You could Either rent way. one or, Ooh, yeah. or you could buy it. And we also have a deck washer there which is actually a cylindrical pan that goes down. So when you're power washing your deck, it doesn't spray all against the house. Get all the winter junk away and nice, Absolutely. Clean, nice and clean. We're just about finished. Do we have a few more seconds just to, to kind of summarize with what we have here? Great, quick tip, okay? When you're rejuvenating your colors on your uh, patio furniture, take a tablespoon of Tide to mm. a gallon of water. Okay. Spray it for 10 minutes and it'll rejuvenate your colors the same thing as if they were in the wash. All right, fantastic. So. Anybody can, and people can find a lot of this stuff at pretty much any hardware outlet, I would imagine, but uh, you can tell them what aisle it's in and you can Absolutely. tell them how to use stuff uh, to the best, of, best effect. Right? Mike DePaulo, really appreciate you coming Thank in. Thank you, Jeff.